<clears throat> Make sure we're good in all respects. We are live. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Let me just share this out to its respective places. Got my tea next to me. Hope everybody is well and good. Hi baby. Boo, notifications are back. Nice. Right, let me just share this out. I've shared it to Twitter. I'm just gonna share it one more time. Two seconds. Right, I think we're all good. So it has definitely been a while since we've played Atomic Hearts. Definitely has, because I've played it on release day and haven't streamed it since. So. Forgive me if it takes me a while of what we were doing and what the controls were. How's the Vavilov complex treating you? You like the cute little bush they got there? That cute little bush almost killed me. I barely made it out in one piece. And now I'm stuck here with this lousy piece of shit, Balan. Here's a little tip for you, Sonny. You need bigger guns. Then you can take out all those nasty buggers without breaking a sweat. Right. Guns are kind of hard to find around here. You should stop by my hut. I'll find you a blueprint. And it'll help you back into that, Volan. I've got some codes for it around here someplace. Your... Hut? What kind of Baba Yaga would I be without a hut on chicken legs? <laughs> they broke the mold when they made you, Granny. All right, I'll come to your hut. Where is it? See the field on the hill? Down the road from that tower of yours. Head that way and wait for me there. I won't be long. Oh, okay, well, I was going to try to be stealthy, but don't think stealthy's going to work. I think that robot's already seen me. Get a move on. What we got here? Oh, my God. Oh. Let me go, you son of a bitch. Damn. Oh my. Granny's just awesome. I love Granny. Oh, about time. That fucking bot almost killed me. <laughs> well, 
I'm here now, Sonny. Thanks for the assist, Granny Zena. So, where are these big guns of yours? I'm gonna need them. Come on in. Have a cup of tea. Oh. Kettle's there. Help yourself. Uh, okay. Nice TV. What's on? Cartoons. Have a seat and watch. What the hell are you? <clears throat> Regarding Shush. the reports, your beloved Sechenov, son. I want you to watch closely. At facility 3826. The malfunction has already been corrected, Comrade Molotov. Everything's back to normal. There's nothing to worry Corrected about. Corrected or not, our American friends are likely to find out about this outrageous incident. Do you realize what this could mean for us? An international scandal! I am fully aware of... Are you? Our atomic heart project My. is in jeopardy! My project. A project I started before the beginning of that damn war. A project you all refused to acknowledge. How many millions of Soviet citizens died in that bloody meat grinder of a war? I swore that the world would never see its like again. Well, well. I'm glad to hear you still value human <laughs> life over your mechanical toys, Comrade Sechenov. But that does not change the fact that we are all slowly being suffocated by Western sanctions. Comrade Molotov, I value human life above all else. And the age of capitalist exploitation is coming to an end. Soon the Western working Comrade class will cast off the yoke of the oppressor. I understand my duty all too well, Comrade Molotov. The polymerization of the entire Soviet population. The launch of the collective neural network. Operation Atomic Heart. What duty are you referring to, Comrade Sechenov? Do you even realize that if the Americans find out that your robots can be switched to combat mode, I guarantee your project will be dead in the water? They're not going to find out. I repeat, the malfunction has been dealt Comrade with. Comrade Sechenov, some members of the Politburo may be willing to take you at your word as an honored member of the Academy of Sciences. But I'm afraid your word is just not enough for me. What's that supposed to mean? The Politburo has come to a decision. And I have been ordered to head a special commission investigating your malfunction. We will be at your facility later today. Do I make myself clear, Comrade Sechenov? Well, Comrade Molotov, if the party deems it necessary, then... Holy shit, Granny Zena. How the hell did you get it's access to this? It's a direct connection. I've got eyes and ears everywhere, sweet cheeks. Don't worry about it, okay? It's none of your business. Besides, you've got work to do. I've well, damn. It's in the corner. Oh yeah, what we got? Know what to do with Volan codes, right? And take this blueprint. Ooh. You can give it to my repair vendor. It won't no, bite. No, no, I hate so, this machine. Why will it be major? Weapons? <laughs> what? Girlfriend? <laughs> oh, Thanks, I don't have enough You're resources right. to craft it. Oh, that will definitely have to be something we save up for. I have to get some more metal parts. I need to go kill some more things. Talk to You're Brandy no Zena. ordinary old lady. Really? You seem a little mixed up, Sonny. <laughs> no kidding. You've got a flying hut, a quantum computer hanging from the ceiling. Of course I'm mixed up. I've never met anybody like you before. You've got a memory like a sieve, haven't you? Well, I guess there's a few little things I can't remember since I got injured. But I definitely remember you. Little things, you say? Well, now you've got something really important to do, right? Pretty much. I need to get to the VDNH. Is there a train station around here? It's right past the village. Head down the road, you can't miss it. Just keep an eye on the sky. Oh, 
Anyway, let's do it. I gotta run. Off you go, little pup. Oh, I almost forgot. You didn't find a couple of rings down there, did you? Gold ones in a facility 3826 box? Rings in a box? No, Granny Zena, I didn't see anything like that. I was kind of busy. Well, off you go then. Enjoy the VDNH. Thanks. I really appreciate the help. Wait. You're meeting Stockhausen there, aren't you? How the hell did you know about that? Little Bird told me. Tell the Crouch things might have been different if he hadn't been chasing after another man's woman. <laughs> Whatever. I have no idea what you're talking about. Grab a car in the village. It's a long walk to the station. Oh, car. They get to drive? Charles. Who is this Granny Xena lady anyway? That's a difficult question to answer, Comrade Major. I've never met her. Yeah? I figured you knew her. Why is that? You didn't say a word when we were talking. Oh. I assumed you didn't want her to hear your voice. I decided not to reveal myself until I can determine exactly whose side she's on. Makes sense. So, what about this atomic heart project Dr. Sechenov was talking to Comrade Molotov about? I have no data about it. You'd have to ask Dr. Sechenov. Eh, it doesn't matter. The boss will tell me about it if I need to know. Let's go find a way to the station. Oh no, everything's off for me now. as well. I have got no energy left in this thing. There we go, down it goes. Right. I think I'm just going to have to do the old sneak around like I did before. I'm going to have to go back up here. Where's the... Where's the remote to get it back down? Oh, it's not. I just have to stand on it. <laughs> Oopsies. Right. We're finally in the system. We can oh. see the whole place this way. Okay. Let's look for the right camera. Do I just... We've got a camera. Are you getting any telemetry, Charles? I'm in the system. Oh, okay. This is cool. Right, back. Not the right camera. This camera. Okay, let's open the gate. Is that, is that the gate open? I'm not entirely sure. I'm guessing that's the gate open. Yeah. Okay. Right. Let's do it. Line camera. Just gonna Ow. Oh, I'm stuck. I'm stuck. Right. Let's get out of here. Oh, 
thought I just stealth killed this robot. I didn't even know it was a robot. And oh what? No 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 no. I thought I killed it. Be careful, Major. The enemy has raised the alert level. Oh my. Okay. Can I get in this car? Get out of here. Whew. Drive feels pretty smooth. Keep driving. Handling on corners doesn't do so well. Oh no, the car's dead. Oh wait, is it? I don't know. It just stopped turning there for a second. Oh, come on. I'm gonna have to get out of the car. Get out, get out of the car. Oh no. Guess we're running the rest of the way, boys and girls. Shot it out just in case. Maybe I can get in this truck down here. Or one of these cars, maybe. Oh no, they're both blown up. Doesn't sound like I can, I can get it all. Definitely just pissed something off. Ah, oh, okay, it's only a robot. Huh, we found the station. The train is right there. Oh. What we have to do now is take a seat and we're off. Sincerely hope we don't encounter any obstacles along the way. Hey, don't jinx it, glove. Otherwise, we'll find a goddamn canister lock on the door. I don't think I can use any of these cars. I think the only usable car I blew up. There are bodies everywhere. They never saw the bots coming. No one expected civilian robots to display this kind of aggression. No shit. I wouldn't have seen it coming either. Robots pulled our country back from the edge of a cliff after the ground plague. A decade go. later. People believe civilian robots are dependable and helpful. It's a terrible shame. Just give you some health. I remember before there was a button that I pressed <clears throat> to, to bring up something. There's the map. Inventory. Just auto sort that real quick. Because there's different types of um, neuro modules, and I couldn't remember how I brought it up before. Anyway, let's not worry about that for now. Are you a good robot? I'm hoping you're a good robot. Greetings, comrade. Welcome aboard Vortex, the unique high speed train and the crown jewel of Facility 3826 Transportation System. I need to get to the VDNH right away. It will be my pleasure, comrade. The current load of the train line is 
You may depart immediately. Great, let's go. Great, let's go. Assuming you have purchased a ticket. A oh. ticket? A fucking ticket? Are you stupid? There are corpses everywhere. There's an emergency protocol in effect over the entire facility. Start the train right now. According to Soviet law, free travel is available only to pregnant women and people with disabilities. I do not detect any signs oh, of I pregnancy. Head to about already. Show me a note from the gynecologist. I'll show you signs of pregnancy, you piece of shit. If you have a mental disability, please present your disability certificate. That's it. You're fucked. Comrade Major, note that this particular Rafik is not an autonomous system. He is the high-speed train vortex. Destroying him will permanently disable the train. All right. Listen here, you lousy hunk of junk. Where do I get your fucking ticket? You may purchase it at the nearest ticket window. There are special discounts available for passengers traveling with children. Uh, what ticket window, you dumb shit? They're closed. Everyone's dead. Nobody's selling tickets. According to Soviet law, free oh, travel is God. available only to pregnant women and people with disabilities. Cram it, you prick. I'll end up hoofing it all the way to the VDNH at this rate. Fine, right. whatever. I'm out of here. Let's just go. I guess we're gonna go search uh, the corpses for what tickets. What am I supposed to do now? Search every single body here? I suggest talking to the polymerized victims. Shit. Do I have to? There are no tickets. The window is closed. I need a train ticket. A ticket? What the hell are you talking about? There are crazy robots all over the place. Help! They're killing me! Sorry, comrade. No one can help you now. Right, so not him. Oh, it's going to be that one, isn't it? I can, I can see it right now. Jesus Christ. Right, let's try this one. I just can't. I can't leave this place, literally. You don't have a spare ticket, do you, comrade? A ticket? Yes, I do have a ticket, but it's useless. How come? Because this station is jinxed. Can't you see? <laughs> I'd use a different word, but I don't want to upset you. There's no other practical explanation. It's a jinx. I'm telling you. First, I overslept. Then I forgot my papers. Then I forgot the departure time. And then I almost missed the train. And when I got here one minute before departure, everything froze before my eyes. This station is jinxed. Why don't I help you get rid of your jinx ticket and your backward superstitions, comrade? Take it! Take it! And break the jinx! Thanks. Not sure about the jinx, though. Hmm, I feel like he's trying to forewarn us of something wrong with this ticket. I do like the soundtrack of this game. It is a bit creepy at times, though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here, look, here's my ticket. Let's just go. And the Crown Jewel of Facility 3826 Transportation System. I need to get to the VDNH right away. It will be my pleasure, comrade. The current load of the train line is 0%. You may depart immediately. Here's the ticket. Here's your ticket. Now start the engine. Your ticket has expired. Your train oh. departed four hours ago. Please exchange the expired ticket at the ticket window. Are you shitting me? Expired? 
Everyone here was already dead four hours ago. Have you just been going back and forth the entire time? Start the engine before I kick your metal ass. Riding with an expired ticket is unworthy oh my of a God. Soviet citizen. Please exchange the expired oh, ticket and the ticket This window. dude's doing my Should not in. Die, you fat turd. Fine, whatever. I'm out of here. Have you Nine. got a train ticket? Rescue. Failure. Excuse me, comrade, but do you have a train ticket? Must go. Grab empty. Emergency. What? Failed everyone. People dying. Elimination was correct. Son. Asshole. Holy hell, I'm wasting my fucking time here. Robots. <laughs> Not glad to be of service. Not glad. I'll keep that in mind. I gotta go. What did I tell you? I told you it was going to be the one fucking furthest away. What's up here then? Oh my god. There we go. Oh. Right, let's start heading towards this place then. And hopefully get a ticket from here. Choose a bit of health. Do some looting while we're in here. Oh, great. How do I get in here then? Oh, it's one of these things. Can I have your train ticket, comrade? It's an emergency. Are you alive? Then run. You can make it. Leave the area. I can't. I'm the guy who's going to clean up this mess. This is exactly what we thought when we sounded the alarm. And now we're hiding out instead of fixing the robots. I'm guessing your ticket's expired then, huh? I have a monthly pass. Has it been a month yet? How long have I been lying here? Ah, it hasn't been a month. Mind if I borrow your pass, comrade? You don't need it anymore. And that fucking Rafik on the train is busting my balls. You saw a Rafik? Do not approach it under any circumstances. Yeah, Rafik's see? Rafik's killed if you try talking to them. Have you got a pass or not? I have. Take it. It's, it's in my pocket. I can't reach it. I'll get it. Thanks, comrade. Do not approach Rafex. They're dangerous. Yeah, there's something up with this robot.
go through the polymer quickly. We'll go through here. Ugh. I can see us having to fight this robot. <clears throat> easy. But, I mean, the fight won't be easy, but I can easily see us having to fight this robot. Either that or he's going to call in some reinforcements that we're going to have to fight. Hmm, what's the polymer for? Polymers for something. I don't know, maybe just a quicker way up then. Or just an alternate way up. Weird. Alright, let's go speak to this robot then. Let's make sure all my weapons are reloaded. That's reloaded. That's reloaded. We'll go with the shotty. Greetings, comrade. Welcome aboard Vortex. Yeah, shot. Is this ticket Is okay? Is this ticket okay? Will you let me ride now, you bloodsucker? Why didn't you notify me you had a travel document, comrade? It could speed up the departure of the train. Maybe because I didn't have it back then. Are you saying this isn't your ticket? Riding oh. with someone else's ticket is unworthy of a Soviet citizen. What did you just say? Please do not worry. Having analyzed the situation, I came to the conclusion that you are a law enforcement officer investigating an emergency. It is obvious that you are allowed to travel free of charge under the current circumstances. <laughs> Motherfucker. Are you serious? Feel free to take any available seat. The train is departing in... 10 seconds. Wow, we just witnessed a real miracle of science. The train is now departing. Next stop, Solnyevskaya Charles? Station. Charles, Professor Zaharov's death seems pretty cut and dry to me. What's so suspicious about it? We've already been over this. There are too many unanswered questions. Hey, I need to get to the bottom of this. Sechenov's the only family I've got, okay? I understand, Comrade Major, but what do you need to get to the bottom of? I can't even imagine Sechenov killing his best friend. That's just crazy. I mean, why would he do it? Why indeed? That is unless Zaharov betrayed him like his other colleagues did. Dr. Filatova, for example. Filatova went after Petrov. She's a woman in love. She wasn't thinking straight. Oh, fuck. What's that thing? Really? Stark? 
No time for dirt now. Maybe not. Fuck off. Get your ass up and head to cover. Spill it. What did Station Off say? Oh, okay, okay. Easy it's like, now. okay, okay. Comrade Molotov is on his way. Head down. To the... Okay. Uh, Comrade Station Off wants you to go there right now and in initiate an emergency drill. Uh, got it? What the hell for? Okay, fair enough. Uh, okay. Anything else? Uh, Comrade Station Off asked me to give you this. Huh. This will come. Uh, you're a soldier, Agent B3. Your job is to cover me. What are you doing? So just cover me! Huh? Wait, where are you going? The slippery little <laughs> bitch! <laughs> oh, 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 for lynching. It's pretty here. Testing grounds. Inside facility 3826, there are many secret testing grounds where you can find a variety of blueprints, upgrade your arsenal. Entrance to testing grounds are marked on the map with a question mark. In addition, the normal repair vendor can tell you the approximate location of the testing grounds with the blueprints you need. Select the upgrade you're interested in and tap the map to open the map, which will show you the approximate location of the testing ground containing that upgrade. Okay, so we've got more open world-ish now. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my. Okay, yeah. Damn. Okay, this is one of those satellite things. On a larger scale. My design. Your what? A linguistic error. I meant to say that it embodies my favorite design. Hello everybody, welcome to the stream. How how the fuck am I getting down through here? Because I can't use that elevator apparently. Use this to save for sure. I'm very confused. Okay, well... Okay, well this is... Oh, the stairs the whole time. Fuck me. <laughs> Come on, not that hooker bot again. Access granted. Okay, still haven't got enough resources for the Dominator. Access um, abilities. Okay, so I can upgrade my shock ability. But no, oh, it's not what I want Major. to do. What about my character? What upgrades can I get from my character? Restores more health. Resistance to elemental damage. Shields you from all attacks while dodging. Hmm. Okay, well... Let's go. Element unavailable. Oh, do I have to buy this one first? Okay, yeah, I did. An additional dodge charge. Shield you while dodging. Cluster munitions get increased capacity. I'm just going to get all of these, I think, or as many as I can.
kind of been unavailable. Okay, well that's fine. Okay, so that's freeze, and then that's the goo. Right, save. Should we try to go to one of these upgrade stations? Mm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how I feel about it. Shut up. Nobody's here. Let's just stay away from that thing. Locked. What else is new? Charles, open it. Unfortunately, I lack the ability to unlock doors. You're like a broken record, you know that? I'll deal with it. Oh, shit. Shut up. Let's keep running. Let's keep going. Of a line. Sweet. Let's get in here. This thing reminds me of um the the if any is anybody play Pikmin? Anybody in the chat play Pikmin? You know like the things okay. that the Pikmin come out here? of? Reminds me of that. Oh yeah. There's a hawk in the sky. Is there? <laughs> Are you planning to disable the Hawk? It isn't responsible for opening the VDNH's doors, you know. Uh, w well, I gotta do something, okay? I'll start with the Hawk. Is is there a Hawk in the sky? Uh, is that is that the Hawk? I'm not entirely sure. In or order the hawk to land via its terminal. Ah, so I have to go to the terminal. Okay. Oh shit. Fucking It's like having a chihuahua gnaw at my feet. Like it doesn't really hurt much, it's just annoying. Can I swim? Or am I just gonna die? I don't really fancy dying. Fuck. 
You know what? Fuck it. Oh no, I thought I was going to be able to get a stealth attack on him. Stay away. Nope. You creepy, creepy ass motherfucker. Just die. How hard is it for me to die? Right. Can't get in. Worth a try. It's the Hawk's service button. Oh. What does it do? It will cause the Hawk to land, so it can be serviced by a technician. How long will it stay there for? If it fails to make contact with a technician, not long. Then we need to move. What are you planning? I'm gonna take a ride on the Hawk and get a better view of the place. Maybe I'll see something. Lights out. Please die. Ouch. Everything's coming over here. Oh my god, more things? Right, let's just do this. Hawk maintenance. Overcoming vertical obstacle. Obstacles. Tap X and L near a pipeline to slatch on and start moving up or down it. What should I do? Hang on to this handle or something? Hold on tight. Hawks are not designed to be ridden. Uh. What are these cables for? They weren't here before. Here we go. Cable stabilize the <clears throat> during bad weather. Ah, oh, maybe I can slide down a cable. Ah, there's another. There's another whore bot over here. Oh yeah, now the gates are open. Fucking piece of shit game. <laughs> Authorization, Major Nichaya. Here we go. Right. Ammo. It costs so much. There's gotta be a storage disassembly. Can I? What are you? So I have 27 something rounds. That's 9 mil. That's shy. I'm guessing that's like maybe for the Dominator. But. Or probably the the Kalesh. You know what? For now, let's just restore that. Because I don't need it. How much for an upgrade for this? Can I upgrade it at all? Reduce the energy consumption while firing. Yeah, install that. Where is this? Ah, it is. Okay, I don't know where that one is. Hold on, where's the infirmary? My god, where is the infirmary?
Is it that one? I don't know anymore. Long story short, I... I... So I can craft ammo, or... Or I can save up and I can get... A new electric weapon. Which seemed to be the way to go. I know I'm going to activate this and cause some sort of fucking absolute chaos. Yep. Just like I thought. Shit, would you look at that? It's that thing again. Be careful. Hog 7 units are quite dangerous. Oh, come on. It's freaking adorable. Oh. Shit. Hi, little hoggy, hoggy, hoggy. I definitely should have crafted ammo. All player instinct should have led me to the fact that this was a boss fight. Oh, oh, it's so close to me. Oh. Oh my god. Please stay away from me. I can't get away from it. Oh my god, hi everybody. Oh! Oh my... Oh, I'm, I'm dead. I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, yeah, I'm dead. I'm... I'm dead. I don't have the weapons for this. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Oh my. I'm... I'm alive? Not quite sure how. I'm dead. Oh. Think it might be lagging? Yeah. Well, there's not... Unfortunately, there's not really much I can do about the lag and stream. Um... So I apologise for that, guys. If it is, if it is causing a bit of a bit of lag and such. What are these cables for? They weren't here before. The cables stabilise the hawk during bad weather. Ah, huh. maybe I can slide down a cable. Okay, so I know what I need to do now. So I just need to dodge its moves. Yeah, hopefully they come out and they fix the Wi-Fi. So I need to dodge its moves until it does like its cooldown thing, where it sh and then I need to shoot those things. So authorization, major. What do I? So I need. I need more metal materials. So I need to go kill stuff really to get metal materials. Either that or loot. So I think that's what I'm going to do. We're going to go on a little... Oh, I can't kill it while it's... Oh, what's up, bro? Ow. I... Doesn't give me many metal parts though, which is the unfortunate thing. Are these red cars the ones I can drive? They are!
Go for a drive. Fucking very bold. Go for a little explore. You've attracted too much attention, Major. Things are about to get ugly. How have I attracted so much attention? I've just been driving. Map. So... Oh, well I just went past a testing ground there. I don't want to, like, steer too far away from stuff. In case... Like, I'm not supposed to be in that area. Well, you know what? Let's turn around. Let's go to that testing area. Where is it? Apparently, it's just on my left now. Ah, it's down here, isn't it? Right, can we... Let's just let... Let's just cool down for a bit first. Let's let the heat drop off us. Right, there we go. We're at warning level zero. And this must be the testing ground. Down here. I dodged you, I don't really know what else to say. Blueprint Dynamo. Ah, it's one of these things. this the testing no this isn't the testing ground the testing ground back that way what's in here fading data what Please was the, the I'm curious procedure. to see what the was it a consumable ah yeah Okay, well, I craft that now. I can craft some more of these, so let's, let's craft four of them. Thank you. 
Right, where is this hunting zone then? That's what I'm most curious about. Apparently it's to my right now. But I just see I just see robots. They said that the entrances were marked with a question mark. That's me there. Unless, like, this is an entrance, but... Oh my. You leap far, my friend. Oh no. No, don't fix things. Right, I can kill this thing. Vulnerable to electrics, melee. Well, it doesn't seem like it's very... I'm getting sidetracked. Can somebody help me with how I get into this testing ground? Babe, do you mind looking it up and having a look for me? Because I'm certain it's something to do with this, you know. How does one... Yeah, testing ground. So, this thing here. I don't know how to get into it. Polygon 6. Apparently there's some sort of entrance, but... I don't know... Like, see, there's something down there, but I don't know how to get into it.
Ow. Take over a security camera and use it to unlock the door. Ah, smart. Thank you, gorgeous. And this is why it's nice to have people in chat. I just want to try to get this upgrade for the weapon. That's what I want. Okay, so... Are these security cameras not active? Or have I killed them all? Now I'm even more confused. Active camera is 6 out of 7. I'm now I'm even more confused. No, not just people, so I'm glad to have you here. Babe, any ideas why these cameras aren't active? I'm so confused. I just want the upgrade. Why is there so much work that has to go into this? Do you mind? Go into them, take control. They are all tall white machines accessible through elevators. Go into them, take control and access the camera to open the door. Yeah, I tried that though and, that's, and the cameras that were near the hunting grounds wouldn't let me do it. So, it says that the cameras weren't like operable. Do I have to go to a different thing? Is there a different tower, maybe? <clears throat> Polygon 6, I think. Yeah, 6. Who's the man?
to the high crower high tower across the lake and use the terminal. Yeah, I did that. Oh, that tower. Oh, got you. Across the lake. Yeah, that makes more sense. <laughs> Thanks, gorgeous. I've been running. I've probably been running around here now for like a decent half hour, just trying to work out how to do this hunting ground. I'm telling you, I'm telling you it's that. It's definitely that. Where is it? Right. Here we go. Oh, there's something in that boat. I'm getting distracted. Right. Okay, not that camera. This camera? Yep. There we go. See, I told you it was that all along. No look up here. Thank you, gorgeous. Right, before we go over there, I'm just going to go run into this building and get some loot from over here. Oh, there's no loot in here. It's just a save point. Anything up here? Nope, there's loads of enemies. Right, let's go do this hunting ground and then probably get this shit kicked out of us. Do, 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 do. I said this was going to be a two hour stream as well, and I've got 45 minutes left of it. <laughs> And I feel like I haven't accomplished anything. I fucking knew you was alive. Ow. Yeah, how are you gonna hit me with no head, huh? Dickhead. Right, let's go. Oh! Swimming is in the game. Noted, noted. I hear a lot of robots. There's no... There's no button. Oh, there we go. Just make sure everything's reloaded. Doop, 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 doop. Let's get full health, actually. Don't want to be half arsed in there. Right, what ability have I got? Yep, cool. Access to the scientific testing ground, comrade major. Okay, cool. You can find valuable weapons in such locations in the future. Yeah, I know your science shit. 
All you do is deceive honest citizens with the concept of a bright future. No comment. Outstanding. Let's go take a look at the gear that'll help me see tomorrow. Oh, where should we go? Left or right? I think we should go right. The dreams and aspirations of Facility 3826's scientists know no bounds. The daring Soviet scholars want to know, how can I make a Soviet citizen's life in space as comfortable as possible? What conditions are key to making their stay outside of the Earth's atmosphere indistinguishable from what they're used to? Here, at Testing Ground 6, you can observe one such experiment. Will it be possible for future space-faring generations to watch movies in zero gravity? The answer is, naturally, for the Soviet citizen, nothing is impossible. Okay, wait, I think I know what I want to do, so I've got to spin this. And spin it again. And then... Oh, can I not spin this one? Oh no, I can. There, there we go. Oh, I overspun it. I think, anyway. So it's not like I can open the door from here, is it? Or can I like, can I cheese it? Can I like, hop up to it? No. Come on, off we go. I feel like there's, there's something I'm doing wrong here. It's some sort of puzzle. Do that and then yeah I'm gonna have to spin this so the door is in line with this one, so then I can hop up and go through the door. I can't, I can't, I still don't know how I'm gonna unlock it though. Cause I'm gonna have to unlock it like here now when it's n next to me. Oh my God, this game's so confusing. I can't even like jump and try to cheese it. Come on, let me up. jump up onto anything on that door. Hi guys, welcome to the stream. Hope everybody's okay. Right, I don't know what I'm doing with that door at the moment. So... Hope everybody's having a blessed day. 
I'm just having a day that hurts my head, apparently. Right, let's loot these. Yeah, sorry if the connection for the stream isn't that strong, guys. Um, like I said yesterday, I'm having Wi-Fi issues, but hopefully the maintainer's going to be out Monday to come have a look at that and fix it. What loot we got? We got something in this chest. Got some stuff down here. Got anything else? Oh, I missed this one. Getting a lot of ammo, so that's good. Right, now we're back to this puzzle. And obviously the puzzle is where the loot's going to be. Now I'm trying to like... I'm trying to think, is there something I'm missing here. I know I have to unlock the door. Because otherwise we're not going to be able to get in. And I have to unlock the door in this upside down position. Unless I... Uh, I think I've just worked it out. Oh, I'm a genius. Right, here we go. And then this comes off the door. And I'm stuck. There we go. Right. And now... I rotate this. So the door's up there. And then... I don't think... Oh, no. Right, so how many turns is the... Two, so I've got to turn it twice. And oh my god. Miss inputs of jumping today. Right, up here, up here, up here, up here. And then we're going to turn this twice. One, two. There we go. And now I can. Do this, spin around and do that. Haha, <laughs> and we're in. Right, loot, 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 loot. Oh, there's stuff that way. Loot, 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 loot. I appreciate this probably isn't as fun for you guys, but it's definitely going to help us out in the long run. I mean, I'll probably only do one of these on stream unless you guys want to see more of them so you can, like, sort of get the answers to them as well. Um, but, yeah. Any more loot? I missed this one over here, apparently. Apparently still missing something out here. I don't know. 
Right, we'll go through this door. And find out that there's nothing here, and then come back. Right, through here we go then, onto the next piece of the puzzle. Let's go save in here. What the hell is that? A special transporter for valuable cargo, or Comrade Lutyak, according to the employee's facetious name for it. Valuable cargo is all well and good, but why is it stuck there like that? Its base features a prototype of a perpetual motion engine that forces the boring. Give me the short version. Once released, it moves quickly between certain set points. It's dead still. Looks like your perpetual motion engine is busted. Hmm. This turbine serves both as a high facility for teams of WSP-9s and oh, as an actuator for the generator that supplies power to the testing grounds mechanical staff. Oh, fuck. Oh, I'm out of power. Pistol is. We destroyed the turbine. Anybody else got loot for me? Just a couple of you. Yeah, there's still a couple more of these flying around with loot boxes. I wonder if I can shoot them. Oh, I missed. Still a couple more. Come on. Oh, I keep on missing. No, I'm out of power. Got another box over here. Damn it. There we go. And down here we go. Uh, here we go. Okay, I guess we go down first to get this chest. Just in case anything decides to try to scare jump me here. That's not creepy. Oh, 
Are we just... We're just back here? Oh wait, no, it's a, it's a different... Okay, well, we'll just keep on going then. However, not quite sure... Ah, okay, through this door. Right, nothing over this way. Don't think I can jump. No. Testing Route Six's planning department is responsible for one, obtaining and supporting solutions for the construction of future testing workshops. Two, producing construction designs for the reconstruction, repair, and construction of new buildings. Three, producing design specifications and estimates for construction jobs. And four, preparing planning related statements of work. Hmm, okay. How are we getting in there then? No! What, any loot down here or anything? Okay, well, guess we're going down. Let's use this full heal. More turny puzzles. Just go, go up. You can climb on top of this box. It's evident. No? Alright. Let's spin you then. Let's see what you are good at. I wonder if down here has something to do with the climbing puzzle. Now I'm even more confused. So that makes that pipe usable down there. This I can use to get up here. Ah, okay. But what does, what does this do? I, I'm pretty sure I've cheated to get up here, but we're gonna Did we're gonna go with it. No surprised to find access to modern weaponry deep within civilian testing grounds. Science and war have always gone hand in hand. Is that what your programming tells you to think? Shall we say that's what I believe? Even the cartoons so magnetic out as revolutionary I think that was the upgrade I wanted. Lamentable though it may be. 
War is the engine of progress. I don't know where an AI glove could possibly get beliefs from, but if you ask me, I'm all about peace. And cartoons. Anything in here? Right, we're just gonna hit save then. We're gonna hit save and then we're gonna hit this big red button and we're gonna get out of here. Whew. Okay, well hunting grounds made it sound like I was gonna do a lot of fighting and I didn't really do a lot of fighting. So that was a massive misconception. And I got a lot of ammo out, but it's always handy. Oh. Hi. Fuck it, Tin Man. I don't want to fight you. I just want to be friends. Right, let's go to the upgrade. Oh, I can do the. I, I'll just use the upgrade woman that's in the in the center. Just use a small one of these, get our health up. Nope, Oh, really? Oh, okay, you're gonna go right now. Major right, let's see if I can craft that gun. I can! Create. Sense of storage. Okay, so let's get rid of the... Let's move that gun. And we'll move this ammo. Um, get rid of both of them. We'll take a, we'll take two big heels. We'll take that gun. Wait, I don't need. No, oh no, I want the pistol. Don't know what you are. Switch over to some to the skills. Okay, I've got a lot of neuropolymer. So character. Uh, no, actually, let's do shop. Let's upgrade my shop. There we go. We did character last time. Let's do shop this time. Um, I don't think there's anything in character I can get for 29 as a... No. Right. Are we prepared? Oh my god. Oh. Well. I didn't know it did that. Right. I'm going to have to kill you now. You bought friends? That's not fair.
Right. Let's just use a use a small heal. We're gonna heal, save rather. We'll get the pistol out. Right. Big thing's gonna come back. There it is. Shit, did you look at that? It's that thing again. Be careful. Hog 7 units are quite dangerous. Oh, come on. It's freaking adorable. There it is. Right, there we go. Off to a better start already. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my. Okay, when when is it gonna Oh shit! Nice. I was really hoping that's what it did. Doing this fucking thing again. One right, that's me out of heels now, so there we go. Whew. Was that a civilian robot? For real, that thing, a civilian robot. You tell me, Major. Oh. You have far more experience with combat robots than I do. I, I do? I mean, shit, I do, but I can't remember a damn thing. They seem different somehow. Whew. Well, that was a lot easier knowing what I had to do that time. Pretty impressive, isn't it? Let me just save here. So I can really have to go through that again. Threshold is something really incredible. I just wish there weren't bodies all over the damn place. The celebration will be held on Monday in honor of national polymerization and the launch of Collective 2.0. All the highest ranking members of the Communist Party will be here. I can fix all this by then. I certainly hope your optimism turns out to be justified. It will. You'll see. I won't let Dr. Sechenov down again. More locked doors. Who the hell keeps locking everything? Whoever he is. I bet he's got a goddamn combination lock on the John at home. These doors will be opened via a symbolic gesture during the ceremony. Symbolic how? The system of mirrors will focus beams of light on the model of our solar system hanging above the entrance. I'll see what I can do. Okay, so... I'm confused. What do you want me to do? Beams of light. I, I can't. 
I can't turn it or anything. Okay, this one's not working. It won't let me... <sighs> I'm very confused how I get into the facility. Get a beam of light, right? I can only imagine it's got something to do with these because these two are facing down. Those ones aren't. Babe, do you mind helping me once again if you're still there? Anyone in chat? How I get into the glass facility? He said something about a focused beam of light, but it's not like I can grab light. I might have worked it out. Great. The mirror on the right is all set. Uh, the mirror on the left isn't working. Something is jamming the mechanism and preventing the mirror from ascending. Got it. Looks like it's back to the basement for me. Yeah, I think I've worked out, my love. Thank you for looking it up, though. Oh, that was glitchy. Oh, very glitchy. No entry and a skull and crossbones. That's encouraging. Where am I? The magnetic shock absorption system is located on this basement level. All the rooms here are full of mobile electromagnetic clusters. I can use an EMP on them. It's not going to kill me, is it? Let's hope not, comrade major. What? So I... Controlling magnetic fields. While well, I get an area with strong magnetic fields, you can use shock on magnetic holes to change their polarity. Crushed by a falling wall of magnets? Theoretically speaking, that shouldn't happen, but this is merely a hypothesis. I've never been here before. Seriously? That's weird. Well, whatever. Major, have you made it to the VDNH? Kinda. What's that supposed to mean? It means I'm kinda almost there. I'm in the magnetic shock absorption chamber, looking for a way to unlock the entrance doors. Oh. Can you open oh. them for me? No, I can't. I don't have the skills. This is your responsibility. Then get off my grill. <laughs> Oh, 
I, I don't want to speak to dead people. I don't like it. Hmm. It's got to be like. I feel like I'm gonna die. Oh! Nope, I just completely cheated. <laughs> that was close. Those freaks and their goddamn mustaches again. I mean, this gun is amazing, but I need more energies. I need more energy stores. Oh no! Was too busy looking up the laptop died in the middle of the grade unit. Hope it's saved. No! Oh my god, let's really hope it's saved. Crying. Did it not save? Oh, okay. You don't know yet. Well, let me know. <laughs> Another door without a lock. Ugh. Where's the relay, Charles? I don't see anything on the walls. Um. So what what does it want me to do? Will that do it? No. I'm so confused. Magnet down. What's the point of this fucking maze anyway? The magnetic shock absorption system was developed by scientists from Kiev Polytechnic University. It's a very complex and comprehensive device that alters its configuration according to the situation. So it's plan B in case of a natural disaster. Among other things. But it is first and foremost a trial run of the magnetic shock absorption system. Here, under Earth conditions, the system will be perfected so that it can be deployed in space. Cool. Science is power. There's no denying it. But we still need to find a way past all these goddamn magnets. Nice little chest. On charge now. Okay. It didn't die on you, did it? No, like, as in, like, your work. Have you still got your work? I don't know yet. Okay. Um... Well, this door is also locked, so... Now I'm even more confused.
No, I worry about. Okay, so now we're here. Oh, this folds down. Charles, what the hell does Molotov have against Dr. Sechenov? Why do you have to cook this commission up two days before the launch of Collective? Everything's ready. Exactly because everything is ready. What do you mean? Are you trying to say that Molotov and his commission want to steal the fruits of Sechenov's labor two days before the launch? Indeed. The malfunction Petrov caused is an excellent pretext for showing that Dr. Sechenov is incapable of overseeing Facility 3826, and by extension, the polymerization of the Soviet Union. What's the boss got to do with it? This is all Petrov's fault. He's the one who made the robots turn the facility into a heap of corpses. I'm afraid Comrade Molotov doesn't care how many victims there are, but neither does Comrade Sechenov. What? What the fuck are you talking about, Glove? The boss is doing everything he can to fix this. To be precise, Comrade Major, it's you doing everything you can to fix this, not Dr. Sechenov. But he's the one who sent me here. But why did he do that? Think about it logically. Comrade Sechenov and Molotov both have something to gain from preventing information about this terrible malfunction becoming known to the rest of the world. Because no one would believe that a handful of traitors are responsible for the whole thing. Everybody would think that Soviet robots are dangerous. Quite right. But what conclusion should we draw from this? Only that, hypothetically, comrades Sechenov and Molotov should both have a vested interest hmm. in ending this nightmare as quickly as possible. Isn't that right? Yeah. So what? We're seeing a common, everyday power struggle. Instead of going to the government and having troops sent to Facility 3826, Hello everybody, welcome the to the stream. Arrest Petrov or end this in some other way. Dr. Sechenov is doing everything he can to conceal the tragedy from everyone, including the government. Okay, how do I... They can't send in the army. There are too many people. Somebody could leak intel to the enemy and then it's all over. But only reliable men could be sent to the facility, such as oh. the Argentum unit loyal to Sechenov. They could team up with combat robots and restore order in the blink of an eye. But I don't need to tell you about that, do I? But that's, I mean, ugh, crispy critters. I don't get it. Why does it have to be so complicated? Because Dr. Sechenov can't deploy troops or combat robots without the authorization of the Politburo. On the contrary, he's doing everything he can to make sure the government doesn't know what happened. Why do you think that is? Because his enemies would take Collective away from him? Now, when everything's built and ready to go, and any asshole with a badge could run it. Quite right. It's all done. Just fix the malfunction and press a button. Geniuses, creators, and engineers have already done their jobs. All that's left to do is enjoy the fruits of their labor. In other words, Comrade Molotov wants to put Dr. Sechenov in jail over what happened here so he can take over the facility himself? To be exact, he wants to lead Collective. But how can he? Everybody's going to be equal there. Some will be more equal than others. There we go. I honestly don't know what I'm doing with these puzzles, by the way. I just completely wing them. No, I know that high-ranking Communist Party members will have more authority in Collective than ordinary citizens, but that's fine. I mean, somebody's got to make big decisions, is right? Is that so? Why, pray tell? Well, first off, somebody has to be responsible for carrying them out. It's not like everyone can be responsible for everything. Everyone means no one. Someone's got to take responsibility. The buck has to stop somewhere, right? And if the whole world did nothing but debate big decisions, no one would ever do anything. They'd spend all their time talking. But what if you're wrong? You say that the entire world would never stop discussing important decisions. Collective is a collective mind. Having merged into one, mankind will instantly know everything anyone wants to express. And in this singular collective, responsibility will be determined not by fear of punishment, but by awareness. 
Has anyone ever reached that level, even here in the USSR? We're not perfect, to say nothing of the rest of the world. Absolutely right. The world may not be ready for the launch of Collective. The Soviet Union's leaders understand this. That's why the party will have special discretionary authority within Collective. What's wrong with that? That's how it's always been. Has it really? Or has there always been one indisputable leader, a puppet master controlling the Politburo, the Council of Ministers, and all the rest? Are you trying to say there's going to be one single leader in Collective? Yeah. I'm trying to say that people will connect to Collective via a neuro connector. You mean a thought device. Everyone knows that. The thought device is for ordinary citizens. But individuals in privileged leadership positions will have special engraved connectors that grant them a higher priority on the network. So even the leaders will be equal. That's a good thing, right? It would be. But Collective can only be launched via the Alpha Connector. It's the key to everything, including assigning discretionary authority. So Dr. Sechenov has the Alpha Connector right now, and Comrade Molotov wants to kick him out of the facility so he can take the Alpha Connector for himself. Exactly. The number of people killed here as a result of Petrov's betrayal is a precious little concern to Comrade Molotov. He wants to take control of Collective. That's why he's on his way here right now. Crispy critters. I never liked that mm -hmm. guy. He's always complaining about Sechinov, but I never expected shit like this from him. We gotta hurry. Where have I, where have I got to go now? I'm confused. This is the only <laughs> door in the place, right? Did I go the wrong way? Hi guys, welcome to the stream. Sorry, I only just got home, but I made it. Oh, hi Nitro! I am so confused. Oh, fuck that up. Imagine ditching this with Fortnite and with me. Haha, <laughs> no, unless. <laughs> Can't just expect me to stop streaming to play Fortnite with you, my guy. Well, this is this is the way. Have I took a wrong turn somewhere? Who said you had to stop on PG-13 stream compliant? <laughs> right, here we go. Across here. Am I missing something here? Was this not the way I was supposed to come? <sighs> Until 6pm and three glasses of vodka. Me, you're missing me. Oh, sad. Right, I can't get in through that door anymore, so like, there must be something in here that I've got to do.
All right, down. Big sad boy, let me know when you need me to search again. Yeah, thank you. Thank you, babe. Um, where do I... I'm just baffled on what needs to happen right now. Like, I, I don't think I'm missing a puzzle or anything. Because I know the past couple times there's been a puzzle that I've needed to complete. But I don't think there is one this time. I just did that. Get back. Check. Right, I'm in here. I say the puzzle was on the floor the whole fucking so time. Are you serious? Things all jammed up. Looks like a magnet version of portal, nuts. but with you more magnets and less portals. Along with the mirror. I would say that's accurate. You're right. I'd probably reach Nirvana before I could make it back down the way I came. Hmm. Ha. Oh, first time. Return back to the surface. It, is it... Is something going to come down? Or... Oh, okay. Have you infiltrated the VDNH yet, Comrade Major? The government's commission's condor has already left Moscow. They'll be here any minute now. If the commission hasn't landed yet, that means there's still time. Just let me work in peace. Shall I report to Dr. Sechenov that it is his requests that prevent you from working? Yeah, you can report on how you ran away from those robots on the maglev platform instead of helping. I am not a soldier, Comrade Major. I am doing intellectual, not menial labor. Smashing robots is your specialty. The only labor you're doing is talking my ear off. Right now you're wasting my time and slowing down my mission. My god. And you're still not dead? There we go. Little bit of loot. Grab all the loot out of these things. I don't want to talk to you. You're going to make me go a certain way. Oh, I hate these types of puzzles. I'm going to have to find the answer to it in like a document or something. Hit save. Ah, I'm gonna have to speak to you. Perfect. 
you. I need to get into the exhibit. How do I open the door? The bottom can be. Yep, it's going to be that way. Perfect. Dead bodies all over the place. I'll open that door in a minute. Hello everybody, welcome to the stream. Hope everybody's having a blessed day. Let's get this open. Right, there we go. That's that door open now. Let's go through this one. Oh. And there's Tereshkova's arm. Two What's seconds. That, metal doing with it? that is a robot waiter. Who's serving the people who killed? Fuck that. There's no way I'm leaving that thing alive. There we go. Fucked him up. How's everybody's days been going anyway? Hope everybody's been having a good day, what you've been up to. Welcome, 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 everyone. Right, there we go, that's just grab her arm. How am I supposed to loot these things? Just absolutely chopping people's bodies up. Right, we're missing... Missing loot over here. I don't care so much about these tables. But let's go. Let's go give um, the robot her arm back. How does it work? Hold it up to my neurosensor contacts. Multi key activated. Guess that works. Now what? Hello. Thank you for coming to my aid. Not having the key felt like I was missing a limb. One moment, please. Did we fix her or... Breaker. The Tereshkova is a state-of-the-art model with a self-repairing system. A famous actress and cosmonaut contributed to its creation. I don't give two wet farts. Much better. With your permission, I'd like to deliver a speech now. Greetings, comrades, and welcome to the All-Soviet Exhibition Center. What the fuck are you babbling on <laughs> about? What speech? You're prancing past piles of dead bodies, and there's blood everywhere. My 
algorithms are glitching with horror. But my databases lack the verbal and visual tools required to express fear, horror, or other negative emotions. I was created to remain positive and optimistic, no matter what. The grotesque dissonance between my behavior and the gruesome surroundings grosses me out. But there's nothing I can do about it. <laughs> uh, I see. I guess nobody expected this to happen. Okay, oh, bye. come on. Set the VDNH to drill mode. Drill mode? This would lead to even greater aggression from passive and physical security systems. It will endanger you and may lead to death of the surviving people, assuming there are still any left. Exactly. If there are any left, this place is a fucking graveyard. Now follow my damn order, bot. You have given me a most peculiar command. All people in this complex have been killed by robots, but you are unharmed. This arouses suspicion. Prove that you are a human. I will not follow the orders of a robot pretending to be one. And how am I supposed oh, to on. do that? Commit seppuku? You must pass the Darwin test. This will prove that you are a human. What the fuck? What test? How about I just rip your head off, huh? Without her help, activating drill mode will take too much time. I gladly confirm this information. Fine, knock yourself out. Hit me with this damn Darwin test of yours. What am I supposed to do? Prove that you are human, Pioneer Nietzsche. Me ignoring life Put problems. Three <laughs> items on this pedestal that represent the three main values of a Soviet citizen art, labor, and life. Crispy critters, now I gotta deal with another crazy ass lock. Fuck, I'm a magnet for annoying bullshit. <laughs> what does it want me to do? Fucking. I'm so confused. Oh, this is definitely going to be like... Uh... It's strange, but the Tereshkova loves them, even though she's a robot. Flowers. Give her flowers. Right, there we go. So flowers are the life. Some humans are almost robots. Strange times we live in. Okay, now we just need to find the voice and the symbol. Ah, oh, these are all just reviews. Okay, that will be the symbol. And now I need the voice. What could put what could possibly be the voice? Ah, there we go. Radio. Such a weird test. So, about this Darwin test. Yes, I am always happy to help, Major. Um... Here you go. Here you go. This is as alive as it gets around here. Hear the springs, cheerful hymn. Be yourself, strive and earn. Life, I love you, and hope you love me in return. Gah, shut your face, you dumbass toaster. I'm sorry. All this chaos is causing my emotional algorithms to malfunction. I found all the things, so... Hand over the objects. Well, I'm... I'm trying. 
so yes oh my I am god skip um I'm just gonna I'm just gonna skip through all of these things Put something to Put the citizen Well, please. Ah, there we go. I did it. <laughs> This whole thing is just monstrous. The robots must have completely lost their minds. Yeah, I know, right? Huh? Huh? Robots. Yeah. You're so fucking slow. Hurry up! Oh my. Stop looking look at, at things. Helping lumberjacks and first responders is such a noble I'm gonna have to fight this. But you, how do you use the arms our creators have given you? Oh, like a primitive just go. animal, like a beast to crush and Oh, dismember. it's doing my nutting. And then she's gonna want to talk to that one down there. I can see it. I can see it already. Oh my it just god. Stands there buck naked as if nothing were wrong. Have you no shame, robot? Publicly exposing your iridium compactor. You do realize he Come didn't on. Do it himself, right? Oh my, that's a mess. And who, I wonder, will have to clean it up? I should dispatch the cleaners this instant. No, oh, wait. please don't. It's the cleaners that did it. I'm so scatterbrained today. Oh, I envy you, humans. Oh, my you God. You can just pick up a razor and shave that horrible, monstrous mustache off. But this one, you're not even a machine, you nitwit. You're just an imitation, a caricature, a piece of lab equipment. Pardon the outburst. Oh, come it's on. It's just that one of them used to try to... Oh, well, let's change the subject. Come on. There's a wide range of the lab tech models. The ones in black. To be especially vicious. They've been using their harmless built-in range-finding laser to pick off humans from a distance. How did it ever come to this? Oh... I don't care. <sighs> this package from one of the defeated black lab techs, provided its capsule is still in one piece. I couldn't care what? less. I didn't understand a single thing you just said. You're an assistant, Tereshkova. Talk human. Shocking. You have no sense of decency. Oh my god. I gather you've already met Nora, the Fuck me. And then she's going to talk about this fucking waiter and worry about. Bang my head against this wall. You don't attack people even when you're in combat mode because you're such a little sweetie, isn't that right? Aren't you precious? I see robots. I see. I see robots. Here we are, comrade. 
The administrative control drive should be in this room. Please establish the connection. Only try to be gentle, comrade major. I have very delicate internals. Oh, what just snapped? Me taking your fucking head Relax, off your Bob. shoulders. That's my joints cracking. Ah, does this look all right? Administrator level rights granted successfully. What now? I'm opening the door to the atrium for you. Search each of the complex's floor and find my dear Claire. I'll be in touch over the radio. Yeah, I know. Reach a floor, I know I'll it does. It for my poor friend's parts. Most of her is on the <laughs> ground floor. Please put her back together again. Behave, you. Oh. Wow, check this place out. It's like a palace. Talk about class. Let me just drink it all in. Attention, BDNH staff. Visiting hours will begin in 15 minutes. Oh, locate Claire on the ground floor. Oh, I thought I was going to jump off then. I thought I was dead. Right. Let's get to the ground floor and then we're going to end the stream. What you want about? I mean, eye rolling at your attitude, obviously. <laughs> uh huh. I know that's what you meant, babe. One one hundred percent knew that's what you meant. I wanted to die to death. Oh, I don't care. You win on. I did. I don't care. I thought you was loot. I thought you was loot. I thought I thought you was loot. I'll tell the guide I found you. She was. Worried. Oh, my, that's new. Okay, yeah, you're new. Oh my god. So I can climb on top of this, right, but I can't just step up on top of the wood. Honestly. Wait, I thought I killed three guys. Ah, oh, yeah, the last one's down here. We good for everyone? Let me just leave this dude. What? Where is that? Where do you keep on coming from? Nice. 
stop it. Looks like that's it. Oh. Oh, why do you want me to fix Claire for? Right, let me just let me find a save terminal. Just great. So where am I even supposed to look? I swear on my cooling unit, these mustached perverts must have dragged her into the maintenance room. I'm on my way. I just want to save point so I can end the stream safely. This place used to be really nice, until everybody got killed. It is a most tragic sight. We good? I didn't trust it. I had to shoot it. Oh, yay. Where did fire come from? I gotta kill all of these the the mothers. so annoying.
I won. Got any more come through that door for me? No? Alright, cool. Charles, what do the special neuroconnectors from Sechenov's team look like? The special neuroconnectors have the Greek letter Gamma on them and are shaped like bracelets. They are worn on the right arm. Gamma? What happened to Beta? Or are those the fake connectors you told me about? The fake connectors do in fact have the letter Beta on them. But the Beta connectors were real at first. Uh, I don't get it. The first experimental prototypes of the neuro connectors with discretionary authority were called Beta connectors. There were only two of them, and Dr. Sechenov designed them to look like rings. So, what happened to them? After the necessary experiments were complete, Dr. Sechenov removed these rings from the list of special neuro connectors. Enhanced gamma models, shaped like bracelets, were then made for the scientists, one for each member of his team. Okay, there are only seven of those gamma connectors? For Vavilov, Korolyov, Kurchatov, Lebedev, Pavlov, Filimonenko, and Chelome? Indeed. Okay, now I'm really confused. Oh, wait, now I see it. And now we leave. Now we can go through, we can jump on top of this, and then jump on top of that. There we go. Right, game saved. It just said game saved. So. So this is where we are going to end it. So, whew, definitely overrun on the stream. Definitely overrun on the stream. But what I would like to say is thank you guys and girls for coming along and watching it live. Thank you very much. It means a lot to me. Please remember to follow so you can join the familia if you haven't already. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. If you're watching it as a YouTube video, hit the notification icon so you know when all of my videos go live. If you want to come and watch me live, it's twitch.tv slash deadraven2001, that's 2001. Or if you're watching it live and you want to go and watch me over at YouTube, it is Raven's Reviews, where I do game reviews, one hour gameplays, as well as upload all of my streams on there so you can watch them in full if you so wish. Also follow me over at TikTok, at Twitter, um, which is deadraven2001. Twitter where I post all of my gaming shenanigans as well as notify you in all of my videos uh, when, sorry, when I always go live. And TikTok where I post little shorts, mainly of online gameplay, of cool clips, quips, and funny shenanigans that we get up to. So guys, please remember to tune in for the next one. Adios, amigos.